Oh, you know what time it is. That's right. We're hanging out with our friends here at Clark Planetarium, and cool. the incredible Cynthia is available. <laughs> you know what? I, I got to tell you, I thought at some point your enthusiasm for science was going to dwindle. Oh, no. There's no such no. thing in, in, in Cynthia. There's no such thing as quit on science. You're absolutely so, right. Thank you. Yeah, you make me feel like I should be excited too. <laughs> you know, you should because science is so cool. Yeah. There's so many fun things. And you know, even though I had an experiment ready today and it didn't go quite as planned, okay, okay. but I'm still stoked because science is all about that like, Figuring yeah. out what went wrong, how are you going to make it cool again? Well, so. as the kids would say, put me on game. What do you got? OK, on game, we've got something called a super saturated solution, okay. which just sounds kind of cool, I think. Um, and it's actually how you make rock candy. So, Ooh, I, OK, I'm paying you got my attention. I know, you got right? My attention too. I always wanted to make rock candy as a kid, but I was way too impatient. Okay. You got you to wait like a week. So instead, you can just like buy some rock candy from the store, honestly. And it's beautiful <laughs> and it's edible. Yeah. It's all good stuff. If you don't want to be judged on your work. <laughs> no, no. And I was thinking, you know, there's probably plenty of people like me who didn't want to wait. Okay. So instead, you can do one that's a very quick reaction. You can watch it happen real time. So in these beakers, I got, this one looks like it's just water. Yeah, it looks, yeah, exactly. But it's actually some of this stuff called sodium acetate. Okay. And they use that in medicines and some food additives but it's dissolved in there. And this one, you can see, this is what it looks like when it's solid. Oh, ooh. It's this nice little crystal structure. It doesn't quite look like rock candy, <coughs> but similar, yeah. So, what's really cool about this is that it, all it needs is a little push to get the chain reaction a nudge, going. A, a nudge. Exactly, a, with a little hit. A disco bump. Yeah, disco there bump. you go, yeah. yeah. Disco bump. <laughs> yeah, so instead of waiting a week, we're not gonna sit down here and wait a week yeah. for our, our crystals to grow. Um, this happens naturally, like with the, the so, rock candy, uh -huh. but with on this little plate, I have just that tiny, it's, it's I see my, it. you I see, see it? it? I see it, I see it. Okay, that's just a little bit of my sodium acetate there. Okay. And it's gonna act as a seed. And that seed is gonna nudge into its neighbor inside this, this, uh, Solution here. Again, you know, we just we also like to caution kids, make sure there's an adult there supervising what's yes. happening. That's all. Yes, okay? and that's a great point. This this reaction is actually exothermic, which uh -huh. is a fancy word for it gets hot. It gets hot. So I'll have you watch. <laughs> they also call it hot ice. I'm all gonna right. go ahead and be, pour it. Be prepared Ready? to be amazed. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Look at that. That's so cool. Isn't that some nice crystal? It's like a magic trick. I know. There well, you it go. is magic. It's science. Uh, it, you know, magic is just science. And yeah. science is magic that works. It's all, it's all the same thing. And you know That is so cool. Isn't that fun? You can do this at home with some baking soda and vinegar. Yeah. You can check out some recipes online. You just you heat it up. Because that's the thing with rock candy, right? You, yeah. you trying to dissolve like three cups of sugar with one cup of water no, no. doesn't really yeah. work. What's, so instead, what's that fancy word again? Which one? The one that means heat. Exothermic. Exothermic. There you yeah. go. Yeah. See this? This is exothermic right here, man. <laughs> we got uh, a lot of energy planetarium. here. Yeah. Uh, if you're not a member you should need, need, and you need to find out more information, the website is the best place, right? Yes, clarkplanetarium.org. Check out. We got virtual events if you still want to come in. But if you do, we got exhibits open, more cool stuff like this. We'd love to see you here. Yeah, we'll put a link on our website, fox13now.com. Don't forget to click on the place. Have a good one. Bye, guys. Bye.